all right guys so in this video we'll be looking at how to properly text your products if they are going to work or not before purchasing them all right now if you look at this place i am actually testing a product right here and you can see i've had six conversions that's six sales and the cost for those six sales is four thousand plus right now you might be wondering what product i'm what i'm testing is i'm actually testing a, a wristwatch by the way and now the funny thing is i am i'm showing the wristwatch to men here you can see the what is here watch conversion men now this conversion is for women you can see that not even a sale but the wristwatch is meant for women all right it's a wristwatch for women but women are not buying the wristwatch here men are the one who are buying the wristwatch and you can even see that the reach is so low and i don't know why it's so messed up so you want to make sure you text right it's important that you test now if we look into this right here you can see that i have two different ad sets this these are ad sets so ad sets are basically where you do all your targeting have your audience have your demographics you know that's where you have your ad sets right now you can see that i'm spending what i'm spending here now this is um tailored towards a specific group so i'm i'm doing audience targeting right here so i'm targeting a specific audience on this particular ad set well on this ad set there is no target it is just empty okay so it's like general you know just every man okay it doesn't matter if you like some specific things so so if you don't do tests like this you won't know if what you sell is going to work or not and i have took this like twice okay before um, i started having some good results okay now the results that you see right here now are just yesterday just between yesterday evening and this morning so between yesterday evening and this morning i've had five conversions okay before it was just one conversion hour and i was wondering what what's happening so i just looked into the ad and discovered that there was a, a little metric that was out of place and i changed it for all of them so all of them have that metric that was actually wrong and i had to change it for every one of them and you see within a um, few hours i had five conversions from it and it was so cool right it was really cool i know it's from what i have seen so far this this wristwatch is going to sell because of course it's a, it's a really nice wristwatch and i've confirmed it from aliexpress that it is actually hot selling remember guys how i told you guys um of checking for products on aliexpress to know if they are hot selling or not i i saw it on aliexpress and i saw a lot of people buying it piece one piece one piece one piece it shows that a lot of people like the wristwatch and they are buying it so that's how you know um, the, the product that's going to sell but of course you still have to test your, yourself before you conclude so you can see how i was able to do that and i came up with the fact that these are actually the people who are going to buy the products not this targeting and even ladies are not even buying the product okay so you can see this is the conversion for ladies you can see this one general everybody then this one is for a specific group and the reach is so so low you know though facebook ads have been quite crazy for some time now i don't know what's wrong with them they're still trying to fix that by the way okay but my point is you have to text you have to text for you to know um to get a winning ad okay to know if the product is worth investing on or not okay before you actually give it um give up on it let me just use the word so how do you create a test ad all right so let's say um you have a beauty product that you want to sell okay so you go create and by the way remember i advise, I advise you guys to make use of uh, conversion ads i've told you guys how to create conversion ads by the way um you, so you can use if you don't if you, if you don't have a, a website you can use messages right here it's still conversion ad okay so you are only going to be built anytime someone messages I've told you guys about that. So if you cannot still use it, your engagement as yeah, and I've still gone through that as well. So, so my point is, uh, the, the the focus of this video is how to actually text. Okay, so let's say you have a beauty product, um, probably something to play acne. Okay, so you see, let's say acne conversions, and then you create um, change this asset name. 
let's say acne okay and then let's say for instance you are doing conversions ad and you have a website you have your code uh, your pcl installed in probably it's autocad or pushes or whatever it is that you're using okay so um i'll i'll prefer that you go to audience insight to get the the real age range of the people who buy the product but of course i usually um go from 25 okay upwards okay so you can do this uh, test yourself all right so you do 25 up ways and because you're selling to women you choose women of course and then right here i'm going to see detailed targeting now this is very tricky okay now because you are selling a product for beauty and acne product you are going to see things like um celebrities i've talked about that before so you can target celebrities a lot of people who like some of these celebrities all right then now you can also target um um beauty brands all right like maybelline okay like mary Kay. i don't know if you guys get this okay so but you are not going to put all of them in more targeting so you can just do something like okay for this ad set you are going to have um, celebrities, so you can have um, Genevieve, Genevieve, Genevieve. Look at her right here, Genevieve Nanji. Okay, you know she's a very pretty girl and uh, a pretty lady, by the way. And so you can just click on suggestions, and you are going to see all of these. Um, Tiwa Savage, um, Kim. Kardashian, you know, these are people who do things like that. Chloe, Kardashian, and Nigerians. Nigerian ladies love this, these ladies, right? Uh, who again can you use right here? No, we're not going to use Jennifer Lopez. Um, we are not going to use this as well, okay? But we can have that as another ad sex, by the way, okay? So we can then um should we use beyonce beyonce is uh, pretty cool okay um who else who else kylie jenna mm. okay let's just have that there yemi alade nah rihanna nah. okay all right so let's do with this okay for this and um, we come down here and you choose your placement right here okay so your placement let we are going to do just facebook and instagram okay facebook and instagram let's take all of all of these are facebook and instagram so you can see i'm choosing facebook feeds instagram feeds all right so um I actually starts if i'm running tests like this i do three thousand error each okay so for some of you who don't really have much to start with you can do a thousand five okay but let me just put two thousand here okay you can do a thousand five because of course this is just a test okay this is a test that you're trying to you're trying to know what will actually happen right um required feed missing the name feed the name field is required so we can say um acne. Acne. Ah. keyboard was messing up so i had to change the language okay so right here mm, we can see the budget right there and we've edited this okay 
the reason why we have it 25 to 64 you can actually tell all this down if you just use audience inside it's going to give you proper data to use for your demographics okay i've already explained how to use audience inside see this is what you actually want to spend most of your time doing okay because you want to get your marketing right you want to get your advertising right because it's good for you to even spend one hour doing this this is more important than making this because this is what's going to give you the sales all right i hope you guys are getting it uh -huh. so we're going to stick with that um it doesn't matter how broad it is by the way okay so this is fine the more you research the audience the more defined it is okay but let's just stick with that for now and click continue now continue right here you'll be required to to fill in your so you choose your page okay i'm just going to use one of these my pages here and um, you can use if you don't have an instagram page you can just use uh, selected page on facebook so we can call this acne okay and see either you're using single image or video depend on what you're selling okay but it would be cool if you can make a video even if it's a slideshow okay or the okay so you can say single single let's just use an image just for this okay um let's um free stock photos so we can just say beautiful lady by the way design your images yourself um it will make it more more um more directed okay but i'm just doing this just for the sake of illustration so you get exactly what i'm trying to do okay all right so once you have that there you simply um right here put in your test um whatever your test is you put it right here okay okay get a beautiful skin by the way you are not using get to get a beautiful skin i'm just showing you that this is um showing you how to go about it. i've talked about how to get come about the test that you need to have right there so watch those videos um get a beautiful skin okay let me just use that and then you have your url here my uh, so this this will be your url to to your uh, page okay if you are using a funnel by the way then you have your headline um get um 50 percent off today all right so you can have here shop now this is the call to action okay so you can say shop now okay okay so once you've done that just click, click on confirm of course it's going to be reviewed before it's going to go live the review first before it goes live okay now so this is where it gets interesting all right so once you've been able to create this this is your campaign right here okay what you need to do right now is go into the campaign and then right here you make sure you select the ad set we're on the ad set right now and we're going to duplicate it if you hover on it i'm going to see duplicate just so duplicate and you need to load duplications um it creates lots of the well from what we're gonna do we can have like um theory right so we can have extra two duplicates of course so because we are drawing a test like i told you guys so we have duplicates here remember what we have on this one this one um where is it okay all of these are uh, okay so on this one 
this one is uh, celebrity so you know exactly what this celebrity is right and this this right here let's make this um brand so beauty brands okay so we'll come over here where we have all of these and we're going to remove all of these So we know exactly which people are that we should focus on, right? So we'll say name the lane. Right? Okay, yeah, that's this is the spelling, okay. Maybe line. So that is it. So from there, just click on suggestion, it's going to give you more. Alright, so you can see Sephora. Um Hello, real. Mm, these are magazines, okay? Cover Girl is a magazine. Uh, what else? Nive, Nive. Um, okay. What else? What else can we have here? Oriflame, Oriflame, okay. No Oriflame, right? I believe you guys do. So, okay, now we have uh, some, a little bit of that there. Okay. And every other thing will remain same. And make sure this is not one day after clicking. Okay. So, change this to seven days after clicking or one day after viewing. All right. So, you don't want to make that mistake to make to that it's going to be on one day after clicking don't do that okay so we are going to publish that and uh, we are going to look into this and we are going to do more of general targeting here on the other one okay let me check this as well Okay, seven days after clicking. Um, so for this, for this, for this, for the, these celebrities, right? We can even still add more for these celebrities. We can add um, this Mac Cosmetics, Cosmetics, right? And what else? Nas Cosmetics. And I think we should be done for that. Okay, that's okay for that. So the next thing, the next one we're going to look at now is uh, like a general targeting. If you are targeting um, generally, what it's that thing that ladies, you know, are common with. Okay, so um, we have this as general targeting. Okay, general general targeting so here we can have something like um, let's take all of these off by the way so we can have um, something like African magic African magic African magic Is it African magic or African magic? Okay. We can see that's so low. We don't want that. Is it Telemundo? Okay. So you can see the Telemundo. And let's see suggestions to see what um, they can bring us. Telemundo, so there is no other Televista, Televisa. Okay, so let's uh, let's just have that there. Let's just have Telemundo there. Okay, so here we we'll, we'll, we'll call it Telemundo. 
en el mundo. Ok. And then come over here, make sure this is at seven days after clicking. And you are going to publish that. So it's still publishing. Okay. Nice. As you can see, it published. You can even add one more. All right. So the one that you're going to add, you don't have any targeting at all. You don't have any audience on it. So right here, we have celebrities. Um, we have celebrities, okay, we have celebrities right here. We just want celebrities here, no want cosmetics. Okay, we just want to target celebrities. That's our focus there. And we want to change these dates. Okay, publish. Hope you guys are getting all of these by the way, because this is important. This will help you to know exactly what you're doing. Okay, um, so then these celebrities. This is um, Telemundo. Let's check in. Okay, Telemundo, and seven days after clicking, then for brands, let's check for brands. Seven days after clicking. And of course, we have the brands right there. Okay, so the other thing you can still do is we can still duplicate this. Okay, let's do one more duplicate. Okay, so that that will not be four. So for this test, I'll be spending eight dollars, right? I'll be spending eight dollars per day to run the test. Okay, so for this um, general one. I'm going to have in general, general, okay. This is how you get winning ads. You have to split test. You have to test for what works. So for this, I'm going to leave it. Um, where, where is it again? This is the detailed targeting. I'm going to leave it empty. I'm not going to put anything on here. Okay. So I'm going to see that, and I'm going to publish. And you can see that it has been successfully published, right? So if we go back here now, we have five ad sets under the campaign, okay? This is just to help you to know what is going to work for your campaign. So you allow your, your ads to run for mass two days, okay? Between 24 to 48 hours, you allow it to run. And now, the more conversions you are going to have from a particular one, you are going to know if you should kill that ad or not. All right. So, all right. So, I think we should still create one more ad set. What do you guys think? Um, let's let's take a look at uh, let's take a look at these. Okay. I want to show, show you guys something. So this is for celebrities, okay, and uh, we want to make sure it's celebrities alone. So let's have all of these as a separate ad set, mix it better that way, okay, so we know exactly what's, what's working, right? So we're just going to target your celebrities right there. Alright, so and for for brand, let's see what we have for brand. Okay, we have all of these right there. And do we have any more thing here? Well, you can just populate it with the brand that you see. Okay, I don't think we don't have Mary Kay here. Okay. Uh 
uh, look at Mary Kay here. So we can add Mary Kay there. Okay. And let's publish that. Alright, so of course we still have a general one. We have a general one here, right? That's we have nothing on us detailed targeting. Okay. Alright, so let's let, let's duplicate one more. Okay, let's duplicate and, and have a niche targeted um, ad set. So we're going to have five ad sets, which will bring bring us to ten thousand naira spin. Okay. So right here, we're gonna have um, what we does niche. Okay. So we're going to have things like cosmetics here, yeah? cosmetics. 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 Um facials. What else? Beauty. Okay, these are things related to the niche, right? I hope you guys are getting it. Skincare, um, natural skincare, um, what else? Anti aging cream, okay, cleanser, right? Mark Cosmetics, Exfoliation, Foundation, okay, so all of these NAS Cosmetics, uh, Benefits Cosmetics, Concealers, okay, so we can go as much broad with this, but let's, let's just stop there, right, but you can go and populate this more if you want all right so we'll publish this and that's it it's published okay and you can see all of these has been active as they have been approved okay so this will be approved soon and they will start running. For example, from this one that I have been running, like this one that has been converting, I basically just have to turn this off. Okay, and just continue running on this one and even increase the daily ad spend. You can see the daily ad spend I'm having here is 3000 So I can even increase the daily ad spend to, you know, get more um, results, right? So I can decide to increase this to 10,000 or 9 and it's going to increase my my conversions okay because of course I'm going to be reaching more people then for this one that I'm having no conversions at all um, is not reaching even people I can still decide to you know still tweak it a little to, to see because this this research is meant for ladies why are, why is it really slow okay so I can still decide to work on it some more and find out what is that is going to work so this is how you test your ads okay this is how you run tests for your products okay it's it it might sound a little bit complicated right now but if you can do it the first time it becomes easy from there okay but this is how you should test your products before you go ahead and purchase or you go ahead to spend so much on the ad okay because you don't want to spend so much on, a, on an ad on a product that won't yield you uh, positive results okay so that's it guys i hope you guys understand this video and you get it okay so for this one that is have, having low reach i can decide to just work on it a little too no but if it doesn't work i just kill it and continue advertising to just 
males probably his males are more interested in buying it for their for their ladies by the way okay so that is it okay i hope you guys um get something from this video